here to tell you. You that you can hear, I am here to tell you. You that you have eyes, I am here to tell you that Jesus Christ is coming and his kingdom is here. I am here to tell you that unless you are born again, you cannot see the kingdom of God. Unless you humble and stop sin, you cannot see the kingdom of God. It is a narrow way. It is a narrow way. But the Bible says there are two, there are two ways. The broad way and the narrow way. But the Christianity has never been a broad way. Christianity is always a narrow way. A narrow way, that means you need to stop everything. You need to stop sin. That means you need to, uh, to, 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 to stop, to be separate from the world. But today, most of the people, they want to be Christian, but they don't want to separate from sin. There is no how you can be a Christian, but you don't want to separate yourself from sin. The narrow way to heaven, that is the gate to heaven. For the Bible says that strive to make, strive, strive and make effort to enter through the narrow way, through the narrow gate. My dear brother and my sister, to enter the kingdom of God, you must struggle. You must struggle with the flesh. You must struggle with the flesh, with the world, even with death, so that you may live a holy life. You will struggle, even in your job, you will struggle because there is a time that you will come for you to choose between your job and between Jesus Christ. You will choose Jesus and rest. You choose Jesus, you cannot see the kingdom of God. The salvation of today is the salvation that we strive. It is a cause for striving. It is a cause for a battle for you to see the kingdom of God in this generation. Because unless you separate yourself from the world, you cannot see the kingdom of God. Unless you separate yourself from the world, you cannot go to heaven. You cannot enter to heaven because God is pure. God is calling us. He is calling his people to come out of the world. To come out of the world. Because we need to be separated. We need to be holy for you to enter the kingdom of God. You cannot just go. Like the way we say that you are going to heaven, right? You are going to a club, you are going to disco. God is holy, my dear brother. God is holy, my dear sister. You don't go like that in heaven. God is holy. We need to be holy to dress well. You see, you must separate yourself from the world. From the minister, you must separate yourself from uh, from the world recruit. Those immoral crop that, uh, that, uh, that, that promote uh, immorality. Those immoral clothes, tight clothes that release your body parts. Those clothes, they are abomination. You must separate yourself from the world. You cannot say that I am going to heaven, but you are, you are seducing men. By your clothes, you are going to heaven, but you are seducing men by your clothes. You need to be totally different. Totally different. 